I'm always at these terrible angles. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to another vlog. I just have to say really quick, today I'm giving lazy eye. Ain't nothing wrong with having a lazy eye. I just have to clarify. I have no eyelashes left on this side of my eye. So these are lash extensions and these are strip lashes. And so I don't even know if it's on camera even noticeable, but in person when I looked in the mirror, I was like, oh my God. And I was on live and someone was like, please fix it. Fix your eyelash. And I was like, I literally can't, sorry. But my fill is on Wednesday, but until then I will be like this. So. Now that we got that out of the way, I'm about to do an Amazon Live. I just had some bags drop. I did my first like little mini collab with Cowgirl Clutch on Instagram. I'll insert the pictures here. Literally so beautiful. And y'all, if you live in Nashville, you have to. I think she travels. You have to check out this photographer. She is so amazing and so sweet and like genuinely like I want to be her friend like she's so cool and I literally was just like like she did the whole she brought these vision the pictures to life she's amazing so I'll put her down below in the bio I mean in the description but <laughs> sorry I'm about to do an Amazon live really quick if you uh I I'm trying to do one I used to be like so good at them but I'm trying to do one at least like once a month twice a month I don't know but I'm just gonna go over I have them all laying on the bed behind me because I'm not organized at all and I have my ring light and stuff set up I'm just gonna be sharing some of my Amazon favorites so I'll put the live stream down below but make sure you are following me on other stuff because whenever I am live I'll like say I'm about to go live on Instagram I mean on hello on Amazon live and you can tune in and watch and if you're watching it live you can like shop things as I'm holding it up and talking about them in the carousel and you get like discounted prices while it's live or whatever and you can chat with me and it's not as crazy as like when I go live on TikTok like I will see like every message and stuff like that so yeah I'm about to get ready for that I'm actually about to go live in like 20 minutes but I just wanted to update y'all I think I'm about to post a vlog tonight and then another one Wednesday I I'm, I'm not making any promises but I think Sunday and Wednesdays might be like good days for me maybe who knows anyways um yeah i'm about to go live happy sunday happy mother's day if you want to shop my bags from the collection they're also going to be down below just have to remind you guys you'd be surprised i'm excited for this week's vlog and this video i don't know i'm too lazy to do my hair so i just slicked it back like a founding father but anyways love you bye nah. look at this good morning actually it's like the afternoon i need to brush my eyebrows because they just are like crazy in the morning but i used a new i did like a little skincare routine last night on live i was gonna do it on youtube but i don't know everybody on live was just feeling i don't know can i speak ever no i think my eyebrows look like very natural like for the beach and stuff they just look like this is like what they look like when i used to have to fill them in and i have no makeup on and they just it's like the slightest difference so it's like such a natural whatever but i want to show you guys like some like go-to products that I have to use this so I always have recently this isn't sponsored I've been telling you guys about like my back knee or whatever they did send me this though it was gifted um bliss it's the body acne spray and you literally just spray it on like bug spray so like you don't even have to like freshly like wash with it or like wash it off after with soap I mean water so I've just been like spraying it it says cover the entire affected area with a thin layer one to three times daily I've been spraying it just whenever I think about it like right at night or I just did it right now and then if you've been watching for a while i still am using this it's the olaplex number six bond smoother so i just showered so i just take like a little goop and i put it on the ends of my hair and by the way this has lasted me for like over a year now i used to use like all the olaplex products i still like have shampoo and conditioner but i don't know i guess since my hair has been pink i just i don't know but i the one that i mainly use i use this every single time after i shower so i'll link these below but these are just like some go-to random items and then i did my skincare like i said on live last night and i'm just like experimenting with different things so i can show you all that whenever i do that but for now i just got out of the shower i have no products on my face at all um we can go ahead and moisturize if we want i'm just gonna use this set of fill moisturizer body and face basic i know but anyway so i was doing a new skincare routine last night and i used like a face oil and if you know like you can't get oil like around your eyelash extensions if they come out silly little me was like oh i'll just put it around here and literally i could not sleep i was up till 2 a.m which is normal for me but recently it's not normal for me the past couple days weeks so it was because i could not stop picking it because they were like loose and i know it's from using that face oil it's like not a difference you can't really tell but it's this eye but anyways I'm getting them done on wednesday but now that i'm on moisturize i've been working all morning um i just edited a whole um a tiktok vlog and i've had literally a killer headache and i know that it's from my massage yesterday i literally woke up like feeling like i had a hangover like the throbbing headache and it's still hurting and it's like 1 p.m so my day like it's just been i feel like i've been like 
like go 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 a week which maybe not to you but to me like it is a lot it takes like it's like draining for me to do like the simplest tasks and like get out of the house that much so i was like today i'll just stay in and do like an edit day maybe a self-care day i have like so many packages that i'm really excited about picking up downstairs my big girl purchase but i like look like shit and I don't want to go down there right now and I have a headache and I just don't feel well So I'm just editing my stuff catching up because I'm so behind on editing and I just wanted to update y'all so That's where we're at Yeah Well miss, I guess I'll be on my way now I'm editing. This has been a full edit day. How fun been editing all day long and I can't edit my YouTube each vlog until I edit all the TikTok vlogs because I did clips on my phone too and I don't know how many. My head is still throbbing y'all but it just started raining and it's like in April, no it's May so I guess it wouldn't be an April shower but it's like the first spring shower that I've seen here this year and it, it kind of made me like I liked it because it was in the daytime, it was humid and gross but like I'm inside so I don't care but it was like still bright outside and it was middle of the day. I don't know, I like them like I love when it's raining outside when I'm like working and stuff. I don't like it on the weekend and when Walt's visiting me and I have something to do when it's just like a chill day. I love it, but I have a banging headache, so I got me some truffle for us, you know, something nice and healthy. But I've been literally editing all day long. Normally, when I go on trips, I can combine those into like just like one or two, I mean, like two or three vlogs. Mm -mm. Also, there is a three minute feature on TikTok, but I don't use it for my vlogs. All my vlogs I, are like one minute to, I'd say they're like one minute and 10 seconds. Like just because like those, they don't do well when I make them super long because people's attention spans. Mm -mm. So I split them up and I leave the lengthy stuff for y'all, for YouTube. More behind the scenes uncut, you know what I'm saying? Mm. I deserve these. I said I was gonna cut out french fries this month. Oops. I really did forget until just now. This is from Hop Daddy Burger Bar in Nashville. I can't believe I live in Nashville though. And I hate having to explain to people like my Uber drivers and stuff why. Because it's literally small talk and it's so often. So I'm like literally no reason. None at all. I just have this fear of like living the same life. And if I lived in Atlanta right now, I'd be hanging out with like people still that I went to high school with. Not that anything's wrong with that. I'm just saying like, you know, I wouldn't ever like want to meet anyone new. Cause everyone that lives in Atlanta for the most part, that like they're like from there or like from Georgia. In Nashville, no one's from Nashville really. I mean, some people are from like Knoxville. A lot of the people I meet are all from different states. Good talk. I don't know what my hair is, but it's cute. It's actually Cinco de Mayo today, Cinco de Drinko. I don't think I ever do anything on Cinco de Mayo. Like, I don't think I ever did even in high school, even when I was like a hardcore partier. <laughs> But um, I like how I was a hardcore partier in high school, not college. But actually, no, I, okay, we're not even gonna get into that. But um, I just went and pick up, picked up, I, I just went and pick up, I just went to pick up, can I, oh my god. I just went to pick, this is what happens when you literally talk to a camera all day long or you sit in silence all day long and when you finally like open your mouth, you can't form a sentence. I went to pick up my packages, I had a lot more than I thought and I even looked and I saw like, I had five and five, I guess I just didn't do the math. <laughs> Guys, I swear I'm not this much of a dumbass. Anyways, so I went to pick up my packages. It's like humidy, hot outside, but it's like five o'clock. These are my ALV slippers, ALV jewels. Link them below. It's from Klim Tie-Dye. I will link it below. And this is from Imaginary Friends. I'll link it all below. This is my little work from home fit. Cinco de Mayo, Thursday. And I have my freshly washed shower hair. I'm like letting the pink fade out as much as possible. So it's like, I have to let it be this like ugly color. Like, it's just like my bangs are different. The ends are turning like this like poo-poo color. We're fine. It's fine. I really don't care. No one sees me, so except for the internet. <gasps> yeah, I hope everyone has fun on Cinco de Mayo tonight. Hello, I'm over here. Can I hold the camera? I will be going to bed at a decent hour so I can wake up early tomorrow and get a pedicure. <laughs> hmm. Okay, well, I think I'm going to film an unboxing, actually. All right, here's all my packages. I'm about to film an unboxing, babe. Guys, sorry, I'm listening to the Kardashians, but... Look at this Steve Madden shoe that I bought. I have a code, it's, I'll put it on the screen. It's Christy Howard 20, I think. But these are so fun and like, I hope I actually wear them. I'm vlogging. 
So my version of cooking is reheating leftovers. So there's Walt. So I reheated um, some do double dog tenders. We got some fried pickles, my little truffle fries. And then let me show you. Last time I went to Hop Daddy Burger, I bought this whole sauce, this whole big old bottle. Dottie Mayo. Dottie. It's not daddy. It's Dottie. I just can't help myself but keep saying daddy. Okay. So. <laughs> daddy. Walter. Do you guys hear something? It won't come out. Uh -huh. No, but really. Anyways. If we moved it up a whole week. Okay, y'all. Oh my god, I'm so ugly. I'm gonna do my skincare routine even though I don't have makeup. Actually, I think I did put makeup on. I think I put on a little tiny teeny weeny baby bit of concealer. So let me wipe that off. I love my cellar water. If you don't know what my cellar water is, you need it. I, I just use the Garnier one. It's just like easy, my fave. Every single thing that I'm using will be linked below. I just put it on okay hey queens hey bitch i'm just kidding <laughs> okay everything will be mentioned below i'm gonna use this isn't sponsored or anything i'm just showing you guys like my right now temporary skincare routine anyways i'm gonna use this uh beat christy drunk elephant jelly cleanser move a little bit on i really don't even need to wash my face but i'm just washing it just like that you know, I thought I could do it without a rag. I was wrong. Where did all my rags go? I'm literally confused. Oh, because where did they go? It's about damn time. Okay, so now that I've used the jelly cleaner, woo, look at my eyebrows, babe. So I've washed my face. <coughs> In step two, I'm going to use this serum, linked below. Couple drops all over. This is what makes me start glowing. All right, next, I'm gonna use this eye cream. This lighting makes me look literally so ugly. You really just need a little bit of this under your eyes. And lastly, I'm gonna go in with this moisturizer. And what I'm gonna do actually, where are my Tainologist drops? I think they're in the other room. So I'm gonna use my Isle of Paradise drops for this. You know what? No, I'm not. I'm gonna go get my Tanologist because that's already open. So these are the Tanologist Dark Drops. I used them in like my one of my last vlogs. My eyelashes are literally coming out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna like drop one, two drops, and then I'm gonna pump this moisturizer so that way it's all mixed together. And you goop it up. My battery's about to die. And I'm moisturizing my whole face, babe. So you mix these drops with your moisturizer. And then here is the Drunk Elephant like lip stuff. Moisturize those lips even though they don't need it. And then this is the face oil. I think that this is low-key what literally is making my lashes fall out. So I'm just gonna put it down here. And this leaves me glowing, babe. No joke. Love it. Love, love, love it. I should have had y'all at like literally like Stop saying literally shh. I should have had y'all at like this cuter angle. But look, I'm like glowing now. So all the products that I used, I'll listen below. My camera's blinking because it's about to die, and all my eyelashes are falling out on this eye and i have like six days until i go get them filled we're gonna see how long that lasts huh oh boy good thing i don't go anywhere my face it's amazing this is just from the beach when i was peeling so it's not even like a pimple it's whatever but love it that's my current skincare routine that i've been doing the past two days but i'll keep you posted if it's working out i'm just being honest this is my first time like doing my glam with my eyebrows microbladed and my skin like everything looks so amazing except for my eyelash gap <gasps> i'm missing eyelashes i would never go in public like this but I, I was wearing these little strips and i ripped them off because oh my god not me just like digging for gold um but i ripped them off oh my god my makeup looks amazing like I'd, oh my god this is like the best my makeup's ever looked and i think it's my eyebrows i don't think it looks so good on camera but if you saw what i'm if you see what i'm seeing ew except these bottom lashes anyways guys guess what i got rachel rakti Rick why can i not say her name Ricotti. rachel rakti rachel rack i don't know she inspired me and maggie mcdonald this is the most beautiful bag i've ever seen in my life it's gonna go with everything i like how it's just simple it's easy um i'm not sure why it's the price that it is but i will link it below if you want to get it as soon as i bought it the fraud department called me and i was like it's me and it's been sitting in my apartment but i've been waiting to unbox it because i didn't want to i haven't been wanting to open it i want to open it on camera but i haven't had eyelashes but then today i just glued those bitches on but look she comes open like that oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god i love her and i just got white because it's just simple and cute and we love her 
Yeah! But there's more. <laughs> I got these Bottega heels that I've been seeing. And I, I, the first time I saw them, I thought they were so ugly. But they literally, so you guys probably are going to be like, ew. But I promise you, they grow on you. Because they grew on me. Obviously, enough for me to splurge money on them. I'm about to try them on for the first time. Look at the bottom of them. And these. this is just like a perfect summer heel. It comes in other colors too. But of course, I got white. Ew, my toes are so hideous. So everything on everyone was saying to size up. So I'm I'm a six and a half, but I got a seven. I haven't ordered a seven shoe in so long. Oh my god. <gasps> Obsessed. Literally full and beautiful. Ignore my knees. <laughs> and I finally got my lashes fixed. I just had to lay on now. My stomach hurts like fuck. But um, I'm going to USPS. No, I'm going to FedEx. FedEx. Love you. I look like a rat. Ooh. Ooh. And this, ladies and gentlemen. Whoa, my eyebrows are fluffy, big fluff, fluff. This is how you fix your eyelashes. Can you see? So a lot of people ask what a lot of people ask, they really do, okay? I swear. What kind of eyelashes I get or what I ask my lash girl for. I don't have makeup on, I look tragic, whatever. You guys see it all. Hello? So I was getting mega volume, like 15s, and we just went down and we're working down to just like a soft volume, and we went down to 14 lengths, so we went down a length. It's like probably not noticeable on camera, but I can I can fucking notice a lot. Excuse my language. Uh -huh. Um, And we changed the shape. We used to do like small with like bigger going out, and now we... She did like longer in the middle, shorter on the outsides. I don't really know, but that's what we're rolling with. And then I got my bushy ass brow. But really quick, let's do something fun. So I got a spray tan and I don't really want to do like full glam. I actually have like a Zoom doctor's appointment in like 20 minutes. I'm not getting ready for my doctor, but I am going to be filming some TikToks most likely today. I've got like a bunch of unboxing packages to do and stuff. So this is just like a light makeup I'm doing so I'm putting Tarte Shape Tape concealer on because I hate my under eye bags. I have a pimple sticker on, but we're gonna blend it in. I don't really need to fill my brows in. I kind of want to just a little bit. Have y'all noticed? Oh, I didn't notice it was sliding. Have y'all noticed that I've been like linking everything below the past video? Like I've been linking all the outfits that I've been wearing in each video clip. It's been time doing that, so I hope you guys appreciate that or care. You guys are like, okay, shut up. Mm, I don't know if I like them filled in. I think I liked it better before. Oh well, I'll play around with them. Hey, bitches. Oh, I had the lighting down. That's why I was looking ugly as fuck. Okay, I don't know what time it is. Actually, let me check because I have a doctor's. Let me just throw in a little unboxing. <laughs> just a really quick one. I'm going to open some stuff I got from Amazon. Okay, first up, I got makeup wipes. Neutrogena, night calming. This thing com cleans computer screens. Let's test it out. I don't know if you can see, but my MacBook is hella dirty. Y'all see that, right? Whoa, ew, dust. Okay, one more. Where are my scissors? Okay, I think her name's Kaylee Bay. I saw her use this. But these are garbage disposer cleanser, cleaners. And I know, woo, whatever. But no, it's literally a packet, like a blue packet that you throw in your garbage disposal and like turn it on and grrr, and it like dissolves. I'll show y'all when I use it, but it's really cool. Anyways, I'll link all this stuff below. I'm telling you, I just get the random shit. Love you. Oh wait, I forgot that I got Grande Lash Serum to try and fix my lashes. I think I can use this with eyelash extensions. I'm hoping I can. You apply it once a day on a clean. Yeah, whatever. We'll, we'll try it out and see how it goes. Four to six weeks, I'll come back and let you know. Guys, look at the sun. I feel like all my my videos lately have been vlogs, which love. I think my next one, I want to do it like a try-on haul. And I'm hoping that package comes today. So maybe I'm going to film that today. 
if anyone cares. So I do my unboxings on TikTok. If you don't already follow me there, what are you doing? I'm going to be unboxing. I got, it's like me and my, my boyfriend and I, it's like one year technically. Well, he never really like asked me to be his girlfriend because we were just like best friends before and then it just like happened. So we just made up a date. <laughs> I guess it's May 15th. Ew. And I was like, I don't want you to get me anything. Like I literally don't want anything. We're not getting each other things. I always say this and every time I tell him that, he doesn't listen. So I, I have a feeling he's gonna get me something and even if he doesn't, I just like want to give him this gift. So I ordered him a little something. It's literally not like romantic or anything. I just ordered him clothes because I like spending money. So we're gonna open that together. This is from North Face. That is his favorite brand of all time. So North Face, if you ever wanna work with any influencers, pick me, choose me, love me. My boyfriend loves you. <laughs> I'm nervous. So I got him things that like he doesn't like. <laughs> I got him things that I know he wouldn't buy for himself. Like he's gonna, he wouldn't pick that out. He'd be like, no, I can't, I don't wear that color. I can't pull that off. And that's exactly why I got it for him because I want to like branch him out. Normally if I were shopping for him, I would get him this in like a black or a gray, but I really, he has beautiful eyes and I wanna see this color with his eyes. Oh my God, it literally matches my hoodie, we can match. So I got him this North Face, just a t-shirt, cause that's literally all he wears. He wears the same thing every day, a t-shirt, shorts, and a hat. Me wearing a hoodie and a hat every day, whatever. And then I'm like, I need like 300 bikinis. I need a million bikinis to go on vacation. He's like, I have one, I'm bringing you one bathing suit. I'm like, hmm, okay. So I bought him swim trunks. I don't know how I feel about the belt. I think he likes belted. And this color is not the color I would have picked for him. Oh, I'm so glad online the belt was blue. And I was like, I just don't like the blue and the red. I almost got this other like gray color, which I know he would have liked a lot better. But like I said, like that's something he would buy for himself. He wouldn't buy this color for himself. So that's why I did it. And it's like a cute red and it's like sexy. And he can like get burnt with his pale ass and be matching with like a lobster. So yeah, oh my God, they look like Christmas colors. Anyways, we're going to Tulum next month or like in three weeks and I'm nervous. So if anyone has any Tulum recommendations, I'm trying to watch YouTube videos and I'm not really learning anything, but that's what I do before I go on a trip anywhere. I get all my information on YouTube vlogs and like all my research. So if anyone has any tips, like let me know. Yeah, so yay. I can go ahead and tell y'all that this video will be up after I give it to him. So that's why I'm showing y'all. Also, he's slow. But love you guys. Um, I'm about to get on a call. What day is it? It's Wednesday. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to, I didn't really vlog that much this week because I was in hiding because of my eyelash. And so I literally have just been editing, editing, editing and being in, in hiding like a hermit. But I'm back and my eyelashes are done and Walt's visiting this weekend and I maybe I'll vlog this weekend with Walt. I don't know, we'll see. Hope you guys are like liking this upkeep me like constantly vlogging. It's kind of fun and it's kind of easy. But I love you guys so much and I'm sure there's gonna be something else that I'm gonna think about to tell y'all. But stay tuned because new video is coming really soon because I'm just popping them out babe <coughs> they're coming out <laughs> all right love you oh don't forget to shop my bags with cowgirl clutch every single thing that I mentioned is gonna be linked below like always follow me on Instagram follow me on TikTok subscribe here and I don't know thank you happy May 11th the 11th 11th that's my lucky number okay love you bye guys I have to do a public, this camera never fucking focuses. I have to do a public service announcement because I, I often talk down on myself a lot. Like I, I feel like my followers get on to me a lot about it. They're like, stop being so hard on yourself. And I'm like, I don't know. I just make humor out of things. And so I'm just like, oh, I look like shit, blah, blah, blah. But I was just looking in the mirror. <laughs> normally, to be honest with you, this is kind of weird, but I normally don't look in the mirror a lot. Like I really don't. Like even when I'm washing my hands or something, I never will look up. It's just, I just, get mad. I take pictures of someone, they'll be like, look, and I, I'm like, I don't even want to see them. That's just like how I am. I know it's sad. But anyways, I was just looking at myself and I was like, I felt pretty. And I don't even have like makeup, makeup. Oh, I have my fake eyelashes. Can you focus? I have my fake eyelashes on and I have like a pimple or whatever. I put makeup on my face, but just like a little, like I don't have foundation on or anything. I just put like blush and then highlighter and it's like glowy. I don't know. Maybe it's the Botox and the, I don't know, but uh, something's like hidden different. And I just felt like very confidently pretty for once. And if you're new to my channel you're probably like this bitch is annoying shut the fuck up but i just felt like that was a big thing because i normally don't see this was the lighting i was like we ew no i know that was too far i never smile with my teeth but i don't know and i'm tired as fuck so my under eye bags are so bad i just felt like i looked okay and i had to announce it because i normally literally tear myself apart so i'm beautiful you're beautiful. It sucks. I know it sucks. Like, I feel like I'm constantly always gonna want to be, like, looking better and better and better. And I'm getting older, so...
comes running out but social media especially is really hard and that's why I try and be as realistic as I can with it because the truth is like I can spend so much money and so much time to try and make myself like look a certain way and I still am not gonna like get the attention of whatever I'm wanting but I genuinely like I get Botox because it makes like I this moment I just had like I looked in the mirror and I was like it must be the Botox like something on my forehead or my skin something is different and my eyelashes <laughs> and my eyebrows microbladed ignore the braids y'all we're not even gonna get into that but so like do th if you want to do things that make you feel better then do them don't ever do them for anyone else my hair like what the hell? do them for you and I, I need to take my own advice too so I'm just talking through it I'm sweating I think I, I'm like I feel nervous right now and I don't know why but I'm gonna end the vlog off here I love you guys so much and I'm excited for oh, what's to come hopefully I keep growing on YouTube yeah Love you. I'm still waiting for my package to come and then I want to film a haul, but love you. Bye. No.